come with me, leave all of your things, yeah You can stop at Gucci, stop at Louis V, yeah Come with me, fly Hey guys, welcome back to my channel So today I have a new video, obviously um, It's an unboxing video I recently got in a new purse And I wanted to show you guys So it's a Brandon Blackwood purse If you are interested in seeing me unbox this video No, not unbox this video If you're interested in seeing me unbox this purse um, and kind of hear about my experience ordering from Brandon Blackwood, then stay tuned. So, yeah, I got a Brandon Blackwood purse. This is my third Brandon Blackwood purse. Um, I got the ESR tote when they first launched. I got another tote, I mean, another bag a little bit after that. And, um, this is my third. And I actually just placed an order for another one yesterday. I love purses. I love shoes. I love sneakers. That's really what I invest my money in. So, and I try to invest in black owned as much as possible and so yeah I got a new purse um, I got this when they did the pre-order a few months ago so they're coming in June I know like on Twitter some people got their bags and they weren't great or they haven't come yet so mine came a few weeks ago thank God um, I only ordered one so that could be why maybe people who got multiple bags in their order um, they didn't all come at time at the same time so they had to like send it out as it came whatever I don't know I got mine um, I was a little nervous because on Twitter there were some threads and I'll try and find tweets if I can and insert them where people got like faulty bags I just want to say that, like you know Brandon Blackwood has scaled really quickly um, but they're still a small business so excuse me we need to give small black businesses a little bit more grace um, a lot of companies go through faulty products and yes quality control should be better but again small company small business a lot of items to ship a lot of bags to go through some things will get missed um, and they may not do quality control a second time they may just kind of trust their manufacturers so you know I saw those tweets and I was a little bit nervous about my bag but it came it's cute so this is the box it says Brandon Blackwood New York period not my leave out sticking up in the back of my head child oh lord comes with this little card on the inside it's like printed but it's you know kind of fake hand we're in um, it says thank you for your purchase Enjoy your new piece and can't wait to see how you style it. XO brand Blackwood. Beautiful packaging on the inside. This is how it looks. Again, I have already worn this, so it came wrapped in tissue paper with a little brand Blackwood sticker. So honestly, the presentation was amazing, especially for the price of this bag. Um, I should tell you the price in a bit. So and again, it has a dust bag as well that says Brand Blackwood on it. Oh, there you go. And, oh, so cute. It came fully wrapped, but obviously, I, again, I'm worried. So I got the Arlen suede bag. Okay, that's my hair. That's not, whose hair is that? Um, yeah, I got the Arlen suede bag. Really cute. It's a really nice size, small bag. You can fit a lot in it. It has a little tassel. Um, a top handle which I love it says Brandon Blackwood it has a little feet on it oh, so cute like when I opened this I was like this is exactly what I wanted so pretty it has a crossbody strap which I love um, and then you know ample space on the inside you can see it has like it says Brandon Blackwood there super cute um, I'll kind of insert a video I'll show you like how it looks on me I'm 5'3 also I'm not wearing any makeup. I threw a hat on. I got the sew in a few weeks ago. Curly hair from HRS. I'll link it below. And it's a lot. It's a lot. I don't miss my hair doing it, but I should have got braids instead. I might get braids next because I just, I just can't right now with hair. So anyways, hey, stop it. Not wearing any makeup, just jewelry. Let me do it. Let me do a thumbnail. So yeah, this is the Arlen suede bag in brown. Um, let me see, how much was this? Um, okay, so this bag was $195 with tax and shipping. It was $203.90. I think that that's not cheap necessarily, but I think for this bag, it's really worth it. Um, not only because it's black owned, um, but because it's just a really nice bag, you know, like... It's a really nice bag. It feels really well made. It looks
looks really well made. Um, I don't see any faulty issues with it. It's suede. There's leather on the handles as well as on the strap. I love the details of the feet. I really like that a lot. The zipper is a it's super high quality zipper. You can zip it. You can fit a lot in here. Like I can put my phone in here, lip gloss, my wallet, card holder, AirPods, lotion, tampons, hand sanitizer, like a lot of things fit in here. Um, and I really like it. I love bags of this size. This is my ideal size for a bag. And I'm really excited that I got it. I ordered another bag yesterday, so I'll probably do an unboxing of that one on my Instagram because I'm gonna like I'm gonna do like a real first impression unboxing. But yeah, this is the Arlen Suede bag. I love it. If you are interested in purchasing from Brandon Blackwood, there are some bags in stock right now, so definitely go to his site and buy it. He has Afterpay um, or Klarna. He has one of those because that's what I'm using. And yeah, um, let me show you how it looks on my body. Okay, so this is how it looks. Ignore the background. This is how it looks on me. And I'm 5'3". I have it on the um, shortest it can go. So if you're taller, it can be a little bit shorter on you. But on me, this is where it sits. And yeah, I think it's really cute. You can also just put the strap on the inside. And hold it like this, which I also think is cute. If you were thinking about getting this bag, get it. Or shopping at Brandon Black would get it. If you have any issues, I had an issue with my red ESR tote that I got. I had an issue with my red ESR tote, and I wrote them. They sent me a return label, and they sent me a new product in return. So I actually sold that one because I was like, I don't really need it. Um, but yeah, like, you know, we have to support Black-owned businesses, especially when designers are charging you or, like, these other brands are charging you so much money for their bags and you know you can probably feel like I'm thinking about getting a Gucci bag soon and for the price of one Gucci bag I can get like three or four of his bags you know and it's kind of like good quality and also you just have more options so yeah definitely make sure you check out Brandon Blackwood I hope you enjoyed this review let me know if there's anything else I should have included that I didn't um, I think it's a really cute bag and I love it. It's so cute. It's so, so, so cute. This is so cute. Like I opened it and I saw the box and just the experience, the experience of opening it, the package and opening the box and seeing how much thought was put into the box, you know, and printing on both sides and printing wrapping paper and putting a sticker and really, you know, having a dust bag. A lot of thought went into that. And it's a great experience. I wouldn't say luxury, but that's, that's the word we'll use. It's a great experience to have. And it's even better to know that, you know, you spent money on a black owned brand. So brands of black, what if you see this, you can send me a bag or two to review if you want. But um, yeah, thanks for making such a great product. And again, continue to support our black owned brands and designers and give them some grace because you know we don't have the resources that other brands have the education that other brands have and a lot of these designers are just winging it <laughs> and trying to figure it out as they grow and as it comes so definitely give them some grace if you like this video please like comment share subscribe um, check out the links in my description box and thanks for watching bye Cause
I kept it real Nice sleeping 